The message I want to send today is that Hong Kong is in a serious crisis where we are seeing our autonomy uh, being ripped away by the Chinese government. We have been in protest since uh, the beginning of June and it has been going on ever since and is still going on right now. Uh, we had two million people on the streets and the Hong Kong government is still not listening. So um, I think this is a very good opportunity for us to get our voices heard in the international world. I, I, I don't understand why China can still have a seat in here where they do not respect human rights, not only in Hong Kong, but also you know, in Tibet, in uh, Xinjiang, uh, you know, with the Uyghurs. So I think this is a very is serious issue and a global issue that not only touches Hong Kong people, but really the global world, where you see governments, they are silencing themselves because of uh, being afraid of uh, you know, political reprisal, econom economic reprisal. Yesterday was a very creative move, as in you know, the, they moved the whole protest to the Kowloon side, which never happens. And uh, you know, they, they weren't really against these tourists. They were trying to get messages delivered to these people. Uh, because, you know, as you might know, uh, the, the censorship in China is, is crazy. Like, they really don't get the picture of what's happening outside of China.